Good morning guys. Oh my gosh, please ignore how I look this morning. But I woke up with a migraine and being sick because every time I get a migraine, I cannot stop throwing up, which is so annoying because I took ibuprofen and then I threw up straight away. <laughs> but then I took paracetamol and um, I managed to keep it down. I've had a coffee, I've had loads of water. I think what caused it was dehydration this morning. Um, mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's always a bit annoying, but I hope you're all okay and having a good day so far. But yeah, it's a Saturday morning. I'm now going to go to Tesco's in a minute to do the food shop. I'm not going to shower before, I'm going to come home and shower afterwards, or maybe I'll have a nice bath. I need to wash my hair and stuff like that, so it's just easier to do it when I come home. Um, but yeah, I feel like my skin is looking a lot smoother. I don't know if you guys think that as well, but I feel like I'm now entering the third month on Accutane, Astrotinoin, Roaccutane. I know I say that every time, but there's so many different names and depending on where you live, you might know it as a certain drug. But yeah, so I'm now entering my third month. Um, so do you feel like it's now definitely kicking in? Everything is dry, my eyes are dry. I also think that probably has a part to play in like my headaches and things like that. Hopefully today we will we'll get the um, console table built for in here, which is where this mirror currently is. Uh, the table's gonna go there and then the mirror will eventually go above it once we get it hung. But obviously we need to build the table first because um, if not we don't know how high the mirror will need to be. Um, but Matt's got football later, so I may do that while he is at football but yeah i'm gonna do a big shop i haven't done a shop in ages as i've been sending matt recently because we normally get a click and collect but we just haven't lately hello missy hello hello look at her you miss me <laughs> she said bump in the camera, which is why it went blurry. I don't know if you can hear her purring or not. <laughs> oh, look at her. You love your mummy? But yeah, that's pretty much what the plan is for the day. again but yeah i'll catch in with you probably when i get back from tesco's i'd imagine guys so it's a little bit later in the day now we've just popped to um the range and uh where else did we go m&s boots and pets at home we just picked up a few things from um the range we just got these two black shelves um, obviously they're pure black. This is just the packaging. We got that from the range and then I'll show you what we got elsewhere. Um, so also from the range we got this little cat toy for Maisie, which is a vibrating cat toy. And then we also got the one under here as well, which is a pink little mouse. There you go. She seems to kind of like it. <laughs> As you can see, she's playing with it, but she's not too sure about the vibrating part. But, yeah, you can see that she quite likes it. Um, sorry, Matt's just boiling the kettle in the background. Um, but from M&S, we got 
our usual uh, creamy leek and smoked bacon pie. And then we also got three lots of M&S sausage rolls. We've got two packets of the four whole roast ones. And then we've also got a, what's the other flavor, Matt? Is it like sausage and something? Bacon cheddar. Hog one. Uh, four dry cured smoked bacon and cheddar sausage rolls. Um, Matt got some leaves. And then we also, um, that was it from M&S. And then from Pets at Home, I got Maisie a Lily's Kitchen lovely lamb casserole. Just thought that might be nice as a treat every now and again. And I feel bad because of the stuff that she ate. <laughs> um, and then we've also got a gourmet nature's creation. This is an ocean fish meal garnished with spinach and rice. So we'll see if she likes that. Um, and then from Boots, Matt got three of his uh, Sterident tablet things that he puts his braces in. Got some Method uh, hand wash. This one's for the kitchen. And then I also got a pink grapefruit one for the kitchen as well. And then I just got a couple of these Carex ones, which I put in the refillable things in the bathrooms upstairs. Oh, and I also got some antiviral hand wipes because I thought we're basically coming out of lockdown tomorrow in the UK as it's the 12th of April tomorrow. So we might need them if we're going to be going out places and you can't wash your hands. I feel like I feel better wiping them and then putting anti back on top of that, if that makes sense. Yeah, that's pretty much all that we've got. We're now going to have a look at uh, getting the Venetian blinds for our curtains. But yeah, we're now going to do that and then, yeah. As you would have just seen, we just measured our house for all of the blinds. But yeah, we're now going to build our console table for the upstairs hallway. Um, and yeah, because I just want to get that out and built and out the way. Because it's been sitting in the hallway in this box for the last week. But yeah, we don't know where to put the cat tree yet either. So that's just sitting there. And there's a Meansy Daisy. If it even focuses on it. What are you doing, Meansy Daisy? Maisie Daisy. but we're waiting for my parents to get here with some different tools as the screwdriver that we've got doesn't have a piece small enough um, to put on it has like it's one of these where you can change the top but we still don't have the right size to fit on some of the screws um, so we couldn't do the runners for the drawers on there and then we also can't do the front piece or the other runners uh, to put the drawers on but yeah Maisie's loving it oh, and I just had a panic honestly I get such bad anxiety about something happening to her first off it was that silly plastic she ate and now she went to climb up on the worktops and didn't quite get there so she fell and landed on her side she seems to be fine though but 
honestly everything just makes me panic <laughs> so just chill while we wait won't we Maisie afternoon yeah it's taken us all afternoon to do this uh, but I really like it and we need to put the mirror up here obviously and then these bits at the end we have got little covers to put on them um, but I'll need to super glue them on just because they fall out really easy as you can see <laughs> Maisie's running about and given her track record she will eat them if they fall out so yeah is she gonna go through there no so yeah i can't trust her um to do that but that's the only thing that we've got to do but yeah i'm really excited i think it's gonna look really good with the mirror it's taken us all afternoon and oh, oh my god but i'll do a proper transformation once we've got the mirror up and you know like a few bits to put on here as well we've just put the mirror back in here for now um it looks massive in this room compared to when it was just leaning in the hallway um but yeah really excited but i'm now cooking tea we've got haddock smoked haddock which i've never actually cooked before so i've just done it in tin foil with garlic blah, blah, garlic butter inside um and i'm doing tender stem broccoli with garlic butter on that and then also um just done like new potatoes just roasting them with some rosemary on as well um but i just started sorting out the laundry and Maisie was rolling around in it so i'm not going to show you that but she's just jumped up onto the bed ignore it because it's not made but <laughs> you're getting the zoomies aren't you you're getting the zoomies crazy lady but i'll show you um our tea once it's done oh and i can't remember if i updated you or not but we've finally ordered the blinds we ordered them from blinds to go um our neighbors have got them and they recommended them to us so um once they're up i'll let you know how we get on with them um and if we recommend them or not but yeah i will show you she's gone in the basket now Maisie, i need to go in there and sort it out Guys, idiot I am. I burnt the blooming broccoli with this. Disastrous! I mean, it's not that bad, but it's probably going to taste burnt because it smells really burnt. You can kind of. I don't know if it's bad off camera, but we'll see. And the butter's come out of the parcels, so. Have to see what it looks like on a plate. <laughs> So this is what it looks like. Oh, it's a lot later in the day now and I've just had a bath and washed my hair. So it's still wet. So I'm gonna um, brush this in a moment and probably just plait it. Um, but I've got Maisie Daisy here. I got a bit worried earlier um, when I came home she had eaten part of the licky licks a packet and obviously the cat treat inside is probably about at least three maybe four centimeters worth of like do you know fruit yogurt i'll put a picture on the screen um and it will show you how much she ate and it's kind of like tin foily plastic material so i'm a little bit worried about her but she hasn't been choking or anything she hasn't been sick She's been running around like crazy this evening, as she normally would. Um, and she's eating all of her food and everything like that. So, yeah, we'll just monitor how she is. Um, I did try and call the vet, but it was the night vet and they said for emergencies only. So I figured since it's not an emergency because she's not choking or acting weird. Um, so we'll just have to monitor her and see how she goes in the next few days. Um, and hopefully she will just pass it. Oh, look, she wants my hair. Look, mummy's hair. <laughs> but yeah, she hasn't been sick or anything either. Um, I think we're going to make her sleep in the kitchen tonight. 
rather than up here with us um, just in case she is sick or it comes out a bit runny the other end <laughs> um, but yeah she literally hates technology as in she loves laying on it but she hates us using it so she will lay on it so we can't use it um, but yeah I'm now going to brush my hair and plait it I've just moisturised um, so yeah, the good thing about being on Accutane is that I only have to wash my hair once a week and even then I don't need to wash it. It's just got like dry skin in it. So, and I just feel like I have to for hygiene reasons, but yeah. And then I've recently got this Cetraban cream for my uh, Accutane induced eczema. So I've just put that on and I think it's quite good so far. My skin, I only used it yesterday and my skin actually already feels so much better. So, yeah, fingers crossed. But let's go and brush my hair now. And my skin just looks a bit red because I've just got out of the bath. But, hair time. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much my hair. It's so messy. When I do it, when it's wet, look how like messy there's gaps in it and you can see like here it's just not very good but it's so difficult to do when it's wet you can't like make it smooth or anything um so yeah but i think i'm gonna end today's vlog here don't forget to give it a like and subscribe if you enjoyed and let me know what kind of videos you want to see next but yeah thanks all so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye bye and i can't smile because my lips have cracked. <laughs> Bye.